One week from today, early voting begins for the August primary in Tennessee. A reminder, you can dedicate that vote to a veteran or an active service member. And just this week, a couple of new features have been added to the Tennessee Honor Vote program. News Channel 5's Amy Watson has what you need to know. One of the new features this year includes five different buttons, each for a branch of the military service, including this one for the U.S. Army. Nick Ragsdale is proud of his late father's service in World War II. He served at in Wendover, Utah with the 509th Special Composite Group. Nick holds dear his father's pictures, letters home from war, even his dad's selection notice calling him to active duty. So when he heard about Tennessee's Honor Vote program several years ago, Nick immediately signed up and has added honor buttons to his collection. It's a little bit nicer than just the sticker that says I voted. And at the same time, as you see, you can save these. I didn't intend on starting a collection, but every time I did, I've got them where they sit on my mantle. You can now enroll to honor military service members by branch, Army, Navy, Air Force, Marines, Coast Guard, and the Tennessee National Guard. Then they receive a button, which we hope that they will wear when they go and vote. And we think about the sacrifice that these men and women who've served our great nation made for us to have the opportunity to vote. And it's a very visible way, and not just a symbolic way, in which people can cast their vote and show their appreciation. The honoree's name is also added online to a state registry and posted on the Honor Vote social media pages, including Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram, with hashtag GoVoteTN. My dad is who I honor every time. For Nick, it's about honoring dad, but you can share a military story about any service member you'd like to honor. And Wearing that button is a little bit more than saying, it's, it's a little bit bigger way of saying thank you for your service. Amy Watson, News Channel 5. And there's still time to enroll to get your honor button before early voting begins next Friday. If you'd like to sign up, we've got a link for you in this story on newschannel5.com.